Hey, everybody. My guest tonight is a 15-time Grammy Award-winning singer and songwriter who is as well-known for her philanthropic work as she is for her hits like No One, Empire State of Mind, and Girl on Fire. Joining me now, everybody welcome Alicia Keys. Alicia. Hey. Hi. Hey. Thanks so much for being here. I'm glad to be here. I'm happy to be with you, and I hope everything is well, and you're well, and we're well. Know, everything is brand new. Everything is brand new. You have to look at everything in your life in a new way. I, I have one bone to pick with you, is that you look unreasonably good for someone who is living in isolation right now. You know, I'm really happy with this particular angle and the way that this, like the, 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 the filter of the window or whatever's going on. It's I working. Also, I'm, thank you. I'm, let's not talk about it too much for something happens and, you know, it changes. People have been trying to stay connected uh, and you've stayed connected in a very interesting way. Tell me if I got this right. You posted your phone number on Twitter for fans <laughs> to text you directly. Is that true? <laughs> yes, I did. How um, many texts have you gotten from strangers? It is a whole lot. It's thousands and thousands of texts. And it's, but it's really incredible because it, it is really a special way to connect with people. It's such a personal thing, you know, a, a text is quite personal mm -hmm. and it's very direct. Mm -hmm. and, and so to be able to do that, and, and I really just wanted, I love connecting with people. And I think during this time, we need it more than ever. And so sometimes I'll just sing a song. I'll go on there and just sing a freestyle. It's a, I'll just sing anything and send it. Or if it's someone's birthday, I'll send them a birthday message. Or maybe wow. I'll just, you know, check in and say, I hope you're having a good Thursday or whatever the case. And and it's, it's pretty cool. And if you want to call me, you know, you might need, if you're looking for right, a good okay. time, me and you, you know what I mean? You can get, you too can connect with me and get some messages and some, some uplifting energy because I'm here to send it. <laughs> Let me know if you get my message. All right, hold on. It, you know, might take it, I might have to dig through a few. So don't be upset if I don't hit you right back, but I promise you're okay. going to feel me. Okay. Yeah. How, old are no, your, I, how old are your kids? My kids are five and nine. Okay. Well, the nine-year-old can actually teach you about technology at that point, can't she? Yeah, he's pretty good. He's, okay. he's got it together. He's, he's pretty good, but he's learning too because, you know, they're, you know, now having to do the virtual schooling and everything. And, okay. and obviously all the kids are, are figuring out um, just how does that, how that experience feels. How are you staying calm? How are you like, because there's a lot of anxiety right now and a lot of pressure. Again, it's amazing how much work there is to do when you can't go to work. What are you doing to keep yourself centered? I definitely have always been a, uh, uh, I've always been a meditator and that's something okay. that really helps me a lot. And mm -hmm. it gives me um, peace and solace and just a moment, time to be in my own space. So I'm, I'm big on meditating. Um, I, I try you, my best to do it every could morning. Could you talk me through a meditation? I would love to. I need a little something to center myself sometimes. Is there any tips? Um, yeah, I got tips. First, you know, I would recommend that you get up early so okay. that you don't have distractions. But okay. whatever. Early? Okay. Early or late, it doesn't sure, matter. Sure. Do Let's just say you uh, somewhere around midnight. Okay, here we go. Midnight is per whatever time you okay. have, grab it. So then what yeah. I would do is I would, you know, I, it doesn't matter. You can sit in the bed, you can sit on the couch, mm -hmm. you can sit on the floor, mm -hmm. whatever you need to do, you just kind of sit up straight. Um, you can put your hands, palms up in your lap and palms up is like rep rep represents as receiving. Mm -hmm. I'm there. There you go. Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna breathe in, let's, let's breathe in. Exhale. Breathe in again. Exhale. And basically you can go on and do that about 10, 10 breaths is really good. And, uh -huh. and then the other thing I like to do, last thing, is I like to um, ask for what you need. If you need a little mm -hmm. calm or you need a little peace or you need a little more strength or you need a little more patience or you need a little bit more time, we need more sleep, whatever it is you might need, go ahead and I ask need, for it, you know, in your head or out I loud. Need, I need a studio audience back. I don't know. I don't know if that's going to work for you, bro. I don't know, you know, I don't what? know what's going to happen. It's coming eventually. It's going to be come. back. There, there you go. go. Woo! Now, you and your nonprofit, She Is The Music, partner with Amazon Music to raise money for Music Care's COVID-19 Relief Fund. What is that and how much did you raise? Yes. Um, you know, She Is The Music is very, very special to me, really about bringing more 
uh, women entrepreneurs and creatives to the table, to the industry. And, and so uh, we were able to partner with Amazon who has been an incredible partner. And we were able to raise a hundred thousand dollars. Now you, you also have a, you have a new memoir, more myself, which is available well, I don't now. Like to call it a memoir. What, what is it says memoir right? legally, legally, I have to say what's on the card. It says memoir right here. What should oh, I call it? Who did that? I don't Nonetheless, know. Nonetheless, I, you know, I like to call it a journey. A memoir makes me feel like, like I'm seconds away from dying or something. It just, it's, it doesn't feel right. So I think the, a journey, cause we're all in process and I'm, okay. I'm a baby. I'm not about to die. Like, I understand. no, I understand. Okay, sorry, but please you continue. Good. You were, you were telling people about it. I was just telling you that it was published on Oprah's book imprint. It's the first book published on Oprah's book imprint. It is. That's it a really nice is. feeling. Isn't that cool? So yes, um, you know, Oprah has her own imprint and uh, along with Flatiron. And so we are doing this book together and she wanted to create, help me to create this moment. The book is called More Myself. And it's really about the journey that we all have to become more of ourselves not how, the person. how do we how do we become more <laughs> um you know i think what happens is is you start to become who you think people want you to be or you start to behave uh -huh. in a way that you think is going to get you farther in life or you yeah. start to compress who you actually are because you don't get to know yourself you kind of start to contort yourself to be what you, whatever someone told you you should be. And so the process of becoming more is a, is a personal journey. And how do we become more? I think we just, shoot, I'm, I'm also still making sure I'm figuring that out. And this, this book is a part of my journey and how I've become closer to my authentic self and been able to hear my voice and not, you know, not let the noise get in the way. Your upcoming album, Alicia, was postponed because of the coronavirus pandemic breaking out. We were hoping yes. to have you on a few weeks ago to perform a yes. piece from that. But I understand you've got yes. a special song for us tonight. I do. You know, okay. I mean, I thought that during, during these circumstances, you know, we are all feeling how we're feeling. And it's, uh, it's tricky for us. And we're just trying to figure it out. So I, so I wanted to do something based off of one of my favorite Flo Rida songs. So big up to Flo Rida. Hi, you got Genesis. a friend, you got a friend there. You wanna say hi, Jen? Hi. Hello, <laughs> hello. Thanks for sharing your mom. <laughs> He's like- we gotta, we gotta take a break, but when we come back, we can't wait to hear the song. Thank you so much, Alicia. Thank you too. More Myself is available now. Stick around, Alicia's gonna perform a song. We'll be right back.